really thank Mike for what he's done for our country and, and to also thank his family. We can never forget the families who stay behind to keep the home fires burning. There's something I've learned so many times how much uh, additional work is put on a family. You know, what, what a lot of people may not know is, is Mike had been out of the military for 13 years. And, and talk about patriotism. You know, after we were attacked, he just had it in him and said, you know, I need to stand up for my country. And to me, th th there's no larger way to show your patriotism to, than to do something so big as that. And Mike basically epitomizes the citizen soldier, civilian in peace, soldier in war. Uh, Mike is the consummate soldier. Um, he's he's my, one of my personal heroes. He's an American hero, as is his wife, Don Lee. She, is, she epitomizes the military spouse. She stood by her soldier um, in thick and thin. On behalf of the unit, the 182nd Infantry, I would like to express our sincere and heartfelt gratitude for what you have made possible. You're true patriots. Thank you. And because of what you had made possible, let's go build a house. Now you know it's bad we get JP down. Yeah. I'm the coffee man, you know what I mean? <laughs> Sweet roll, that. whatever. That's it. Yeah. Well, we're going to go help the house. Oh, appreciate no, it. Me, it means everything. That, that alone is going to be Not just more, you know, me, but for the family. Just to be able to do the Because it's always. this way I can get around on my own. Nobody has to follow me around. Nobody has to help me. Just a little adds a lot more normalcy. So when I do come home for good, I can just pick up and move on. Well, we'll have this house up in watertight in three days. We, we have a, a massive crew here. Uh, you, know, you know, it's, it's great. Just five, five years ago this month, we broke ground on our first house, and, and here we are back where it started. Well, you know, what we're doing here, the, this kind of support is, is, is so important. You know, we're, we're talking about soldiers who, who suffered tremendous injuries and just, you know, to, to mentally uh, try to ease things for them and let them know that, you know, people are behind them. The last thing that we want is uh, this current generation of veterans to, to have to go through the, the feelings of uh, that people don't care, like uh, what happened with Vietnam veterans. It's, uh, you know, if we can impact their state of mind, that will directly help their physical healing process. And, you know, that's what this is. This is the beginning of the healing process. 